Hi everyone. The Vikings, renowned for their longships, were seafaring people from the late 8th to early 11th centuries, known as the Viking Age. Here are some lesser known facts about the Viking longships and their voyages from the Viking Age throughout the Middle Ages. Longship Design Viking longships were expertly designed for both shallow river navigation and open sea journeys. Their sleek, slender hulls and shallow drafts allowed them to navigate rivers and reach inland settlements, making them formidable raiders. Additionally, their flexible oars and square sails made them highly maneuverable. Shipbuilding Longships were constructed primarily using oak wood, which was both sturdy and abundant in Scandinavia. However, the process of building a longship was complex and required skilled shipwrights. Some longships were built using a clinker construction method, where overlapping planks were riveted together, ensuring a watertight and flexible structure. Crew and Rolls A typical longship crew consisted of around 40 to 60 men, although larger ships could carry more. The crew members had different roles, including rowers, fighters, navigators, and lookouts. The oarsmen, usually seated in pairs, worked in unison to propel the ship forward. Exploration and Trade While Vikings are often associated with raiding and pillaging, they were also skilled explorers and traders. They established trade routes that stretched from the Mediterranean to the Black Sea, and even reached as far as North America, Vinland around the 10th century, long before Christopher Columbus's voyages. Rituals and Burials Vikings had strong beliefs in the afterlife and honored their dead with elaborate burial rituals. It was not uncommon for chieftains or influential individuals to be buried in longships, either on land or set to sea in a ceremonial ship burial, alongside valuable possessions and sometimes even sacrificed slaves or animals. Adaptation to Conditions Vikings were innovative in their ship designs, and their longships were adapted to suit different conditions. Some longships were broader and more stable, suited for rough sea voyages, while others were more slender and agile for river journeys or coastal raids. Decline of Longships As Europe moved into the Middle Ages, the significance of longships began to decline. Changing political landscapes, advances in shipbuilding techniques, and the adoption of Christianity played a role in the decline of Viking longships as a dominant force in naval warfare and exploration. Viking Ship Museums Several museums around the world exhibit well-preserved Viking longships and artifacts, providing valuable insights into Viking culture and shipbuilding skills. Notable examples include the Viking Ship Museum in Oslo, Norway, and the Roskiller Viking Ship Museum in Denmark. Viking longships remain iconic symbols of the Viking Age and continue to capture the imagination of people worldwide. Their impact on history, exploration, and maritime innovation is a testament to the prowess of these ancient seafarers. Here are some amusing facts about Viking longships, or Drakkar, and their voyages. Universal GPS When Vikings set out on their long journeys aboard their longships, they certainly didn't have modern navigation systems. Instead, they used a funny and primitive method, observing the behavior of birds and animals. For example, if they saw a lot of seabirds flying in a certain direction, they knew there was land in that direction. Deceptive ships Some Vikings used their longships to deceive their enemies. They would set up lyres and other musical instruments on the prows of their ships and play melodies to create the impression of a massive armada approaching. This could intimidate and confuse their foes, giving the Vikings an advantage. Ghost Ships Many legends and myths about Vikings mention ghost ships. These ships represent hope and the symbol of long and perilous sea voyages. It's often said that these ghost ships can only be seen by the chosen ones or the dying, adding a humorous touch of mystique. Ship Hairstyles According to archaeologists, Vikings were fashionable and cared about their appearance. 
Some of them likely created funny hairstyles using seaweed and other materials they found on the shores to give themselves an extravagant look during their journeys. Water Festivals Vikings were known for being fun-loving and enjoyed celebrating various events. When they successfully returned from their distant voyages on their longships, they could throw huge water festivals, competing in boat races and hosting feasts. While Vikings were serious and courageous travelers, they also had their bright and humorous sides, adding a comedic dimension to their history and legends. Thanks for watching.